tip for the day about fishing slicks. So as you can see, I hope you can see this is slick over here. So no doubt the guys that come from Texas, they real big on fishing slicks. I really didn't believe much of that when I'm fishing by boats in southeast Louisiana because there's a lot of, a lot of all, oh, there's a lot of crab traps, there's all kind of things going on, make slicks for ungodly reasons. But out here when we're fishing in the sand, fishing sand to their islands, we do fish slicks. So, uh, so sports. <laughs> this morning it's a little windy. Uh, we got a few nice fish on a stringer and all them fish came from slicks. So if you're out in the water and you see a slick form, like from a perfect little teardrop, maybe two, three foot round, that's the one you want to be ahead of. You got to compensate for wind direction, current direction, but you will pick up fish. So these boys are That's the game. So the bait of choice today is a palmer, civil mullet, which is uh, basically like a little smoke grub. Uh, quarter ounce jig head, little palmer, you know, quarter ounce jig head with that. Uh, great hook, great combination out here walking around. We basically need deeper water, catch some two and three pound speckle trout. Maybe a little later on, throw some little top water to give it a shot. But that's your tip for the day. You gotta have bomber, gotta fish a slick, gotta know how to fish a slick. Don't walk through it, walk up to it. Cool. Hey y'all, cutting Tophia Bourgeois. Tip of the day.